Good morning. I am Rohit and today I will help you learn how to create retail and tax invoice voucher series. I have opened a company Anita International Demo Company and in this company I will go to accounts info and voucher types. Some voucher types have already been created and in sales I have only one voucher type. I will create sales retail under sales sl retail or you can put some abbreviation it can be sl R. Voucher numbering can be automatic. We can have the title mentioned here. Is it, is it a tax invoice? No. And if I want to create a class, I can create the class here. Otherwise, I save this voucher. Again, I enter sales tax invoice under sales SL. automatic tax invoice is it a tax invoice yes you can create a class here otherwise I accept this form we can quit this form and go to accounting vouchers in accounting vouchers, I select sales. So what it is showing that the default voucher type, the voucher two voucher types which I have created. So the unique feature of creating two parallel voucher types is number one, both these series start from one and they run parallel to each other. The retail will be starting from one number and the tax invoice series would also be starting from one number. Moreover, if I see the print preview, the title on the retail invoice would be retail invoice original and title On the tax invoice would be tax invoice. Sometimes you must have observed that this word original purchaser copy or valid for input tax credit is not coming on your invoice. It is because I have given command for two copies. If you give command of one copy, then, then they will not appear. So you can see how simple is it to create retail and tax invoice voucher series and both starting from one number. Today, we have learned how to create retail invoice series and tax invoice series in Tally. Do join our group Discover Tally in YouTube. Please subscribe to this group. Thank you.